This is a tutorial on how to install the EK water block onto the MSI GTX 780 Lightning. First, remove the GPU reactor cover by pinching down on two opposite sides and lifting up. Next, remove the screws securing the back plate to the GPU and the cooler. There are 8 around the outer perimeter and 4 around the reactor module. There are two more screws around the I.O. area that you need to remove. Now you can remove the GPU reactor module by simply lifting it off the PCB. Pull the cooler off the GPU and unplug the fans. Remove the heat spreader plate by peeling it away gently. Clean thermal paste off your GPU just like you would do with the CPU by using isopropyl alcohol, cotton swabs, or a paper towel. Include it with your water block or thermal pads. Cut them, remove the protective foil on both sides, and place them over the VRM and memory modules. If you're unsure of where to put them, you can double check your diagram in the manual. Apply thermal paste just like you would do with the CPU by drawing a thin line down the middle. Gently mount the water block to the GPU. Be sure not to apply downward pressure because GPU dies are sensitive to cracking. Flip over the graphics card. At this point, you can choose to reuse the backplate, but in any case, use the screws provided with the water block. After installing the block, just attach fittings and tubing just like it would do with any part of your water cooling loop and reinstall the GPU reactor module. Now you're ready to include your graphics card as part of your water cooling loop. Thank you very much for watching. Leave a like rating if my video was informative. Be sure to subscribe to my channel for all things PC gaming. My name is David and I'll see you next video.